So here we're using passive range holds to improve our strength and control at end range hip flexion and uh, hamstring lengthening. All right, and we're also trying to bridge the gap between active and passive range of motion. So here, I'm working my right leg, my left heel is driving down into something solid. I'm using the band to pull up as far as I can go in a pain-free passive stretch. So as far as my leg will go pain-free. I keep a slight bend in my knee so that I feel most of the stretch through here. And I pull. Once I've achieved this, I'll hold it for a moment. Then I'm going to slowly let go and use all of these tissues to try to hold my position and not lose it. So here, I'm going to let go and hold, 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 and I can hold for three to 20 seconds, trying not to lose that angle, and then reset, relax, breathe, and then you can repeat, and really your intent is to not lose a millimeter here. You're trying to keep this angle as best you can, so I'm pulling in, let it go, and try to hold, three, two, one, and I'm relaxing back. I like to do maybe three to five reps depending on the intensity. Um, really great way to improve your end range control.